Do you love chia seeds? Well, try this delicious twist on an Herbalife Formula One shake. I'm Susan Bowerman, registered dietitian, and today I'm doing something really fun with my Herbalife Formula One shake. I'm gonna turn it into a pudding using chia seeds and it's really easy. So let me show you how to do it. I'm gonna make my shake in a shaker bottle. You don't even need the blender for this one, which makes it great. And I'm just gonna start by using eight ounces, that's 250 milliliters of low fat milk. You can use soy milk if you want to. And then I'm using Herbalife Formula One berry flavor and I've already shaken up my canister. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in my two scoops. There's one, two. And now for the secret ingredient. I'm gonna use two tablespoons of white chia seeds. Little tiny seeds. And then, put this on nice and tight and I'm going to shake this up. Now you want to shake this up so that it gets well mixed and then the key is you want to let this sit for a couple of minutes and the reason is is that chia seeds are very interesting seeds because they have a lot of soluble fiber in them and so one of the reasons that I want to let this mixture sit for a couple of minutes is because that soluble fiber is going to start to absorb the liquid that's in the shake. In fact, chia seeds take up about 10 times their weight in liquid, and that's what's going to turn my shake into a pudding. So it's gonna sit for a couple of minutes while I prepare the rest of the ingredients for the shake. Periodically, you can pick it up, shake it up a little bit more, and it's starting to thicken up already and the seeds are starting to mix really, really well with the liquid. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some fruit on the bottom of my shake. I'm just gonna mash them up a little bit. I'm using a half a cup of fruit, which is about 100 grams. I've got raspberries and I've got blackberries and I've got blueberries in here. And this flavor should go really nicely with my berry shake. And now I'm just gonna scoop this up and I'm gonna put this in the bottom of the glass. There we go. Shake this up just one more time before I pour it in. And I think you can see it's already thickening up a little bit and the seeds are pretty well mixed in. So I'm gonna pour this on top. That's so pretty. This looks great. Now, all you have to do is just cover it with some plastic wrap and put it in the refrigerator overnight. And that's what I'm gonna do. Well, here it is. Here's my Herbalife Formula One Chia Pudding. It's been sitting in the refrigerator overnight. And I want you to see how thick it is. And you can see it's really set, just like pudding. Let's see what it tastes like. Now, I like to just kind of dig down, get a little bite of fruit with my pudding. This is so good. I wish that you could taste it. It's got a nice texture. It almost tastes like a tapioca pudding. Now, as I've made this with the fruit, with the chia seeds, this glass has about 350 calories. It also has eight grams of fiber, which is about a third of the fiber that you need for the whole day. And the chia seeds have added an additional three grams of protein. So I hope that I have inspired you to play with the chia seed recipe and try your own Herbalife Formula One chia pudding and let me know how yours tastes.